hey encourage me fam i hope you guys are doing well this week i know that i was supposed to post on monday and believe me this week this week was a roller coaster week for me i don't know about you but um i must say that this week was a roller coaster for me and it really allowed me to even miss some appointments or miss some stuff that i was supposed to do because i pretty much got the days you know mixed up and um but nonetheless but nonetheless i i'm not gonna fail you guys even though i didn't get to post on monday here i am here i am today with another posting you know today i want to talk to you guys um this is a two-part you know on the theme of staying grounded in spite of staying grounded in spite of and the first part of this series is gonna focus on no matter how busy you are don't forget your goal no matter how busy you are don't forget your goal stay grounded in spite of you see let me use myself for example this week as i started out by saying i had a lot going on <laughs> i had so much going on to the point i was like oh man i'm packed i'm full i need to let go of some of these things you know and i have been saying these you know saying these things for a while and yes i did let go of certain things but then i still you know kept some because you know those um need need some garnering you know to make them better and oftentimes you know we are so swamped to the point where we just want to call it quits and I did not call it quits I'm so proud of myself what I did is I met with my counselor and I talked to her about you know how that I'm going through um, my anxiety for one it you know it came back and I was like what's going on I I almost had anxiety attacking in two on two occasions sorry and um i'm just grateful to god that he brought me through and the the project that i was working on when i almost got the anxiety attack i came out on top i was so excited when i saw the result and at that point you know i was like yes i did great and so I want us to remember the goal. Remember why we started out in the first place. Remember why we're doing what we say we are doing. Because if we lose track or if we lost track of the goal, then we are just failing our audience or we're failing ourselves for that matter. You see, when we you know forget the hen goal when we forget the result um uh, what we want to achieve at the end you know it's like we are saying to ourselves that it's better i didn't start in the first place what i want to commend you for is starting just like today i was talking to one of my students and you know she was trying to help another student tie her shoelace and she tried a, a few times she tried you know and she could not get it and then she was like i cannot do this i cannot i stopped her and i said at least you tried you see, many times we forget the effort that we put in. Many times we forget the effort that we put in to accomplish great things. If we forget what we are about, if we forget what we do, then we will 
we will not see great result in the end. We cannot forget the goal. We cannot forget the effort that we put in to become successful. We cannot forget the reason why we're on this journey. If we forget the reason why we're on this journey, then we're just like, failing ourselves, and we're failing everybody that supports us. And so I want us to remember the goal. Remember why we start out in the first place. You see, I made a promise to the Encourage Me podcast community. And I said to you that... I am coming back. And that's a promise I made. Because there is a goal. The goal is to post encouragement. The goal is to encourage and uplift others so that they can continue on their journey. Our vision should not be forgotten. Our vision should not be forgotten. You see, I talked about in the past where if we're doing something and we're watching the crowd, we're not going to grow. And that's so true. We can't watch how many people are strolling behind us. Like I shared, if we only have one, we got to push through it. We got to encourage that one because that one person sees something important in this thing. If they never saw the thing important, they would not have subscribed. They would not have followed. And so we got to remember the goal. Remember, the race is not for the swift, nor the battle for the strong, but those who can endure to the end. The goal. We got to remember the goal. Remember why we are on this journey. So whenever you step out and you're walking on thorns and it's so painful and you're just like, what is this I am doing to myself? You got to remember the goal. Remember the end result remember that hey we're not perfect but we are on a journey that can help us to perfect those imperfections we're on a journey that we will see ourselves as important And we will see the vision as important. And we will see the beautiful end result. The goal should be protected. The vision should be protected. So whatever you are doing today. Do it with all your might. Do it because you care. Do it because you want to make change. Do it. Do it. Do it to make impact all over the world. Sometimes you're going to get frustrated. Sometimes you're going to question your vision, question your goal, and question if this is the right thing. I've been there. But let me tell you something. In the midst of your questioning, impact is being made. So don't forget that you are creating impact. Once again, the race is not for the swift, 
nor the battle for the strong, but those who can endure to the end. I pray you were blessed today. I'm coming back next week with part two. So part two, I'm going to talk about something very powerful. And so if you want to hear what that is about, you got to stay locked in to the Encourage Me fam. And you got to subscribe. You got to follow me over here on you know, Spotify and or Google Podcasts, wherever you're listening to me from. And I also have an Encourage Me platform on YouTube. So it's Encourage Me with the capital N. Um, and that's where I also post inspirational videos. So if you want to stay connected to the Encourage Me fam, please like, um, share, share, leave a comment. Uh, send me a voice message to tell me how this message uplifted your spirit today. Don't forget your goal. Don't forget your vision. Stay tuned for more to come on the Encourage Me podcast. Remember, God love you and I love you. God bless you.